Man finds alien bug that looks like Stranger Things monster. Let me guess where it was found. Australia. Where all oversized and shouldn't exist creatures live. What's going on YouTube? I'm your host Joss and welcome back to Inform Overload, the place that makes the news less newsy and more fun. Although there is nothing fun about this alien bug that is literally the size of my head. Make sure you are following the IO team on social media. You can find our links in the description below and hit that notification bell so that you don't miss another story. I promise not every story will give you the creeps like this one will. Surprisingly though, this bug was not found in Australia, but was found in a home in Bali, Indonesia. A man was surprised one evening after seeing this creature crawling across his ceiling without a care in the world. Come on in bug, the world is yours, we just live in it. On June 17th, the bizarre creature stunned residents when it was spotted by the homeowner named Harry Tao, who had no understanding where it came from. But regardless of how scary it was, the first thing he thought was to take a video. In all honesty though, I probably would have done the same thing because there is no way to describe something like this and people probably wouldn't believe you even if you did. The best way to describe this bug is that it looks like the monster from the Netflix show Stranger Things. Like literally, it looks like that but a real life version, it's just obviously smaller. The top half of the bug isn't so bad, it has regular looking bug legs and wings but then you get to the bottom half and it's like a mix of an octopus and a tarantula. It has four long transparent legs that are hairy and do this weird pulsation motion. They even move and bend like human fingers. The owner was first confused on how the bug even got in the house, but said that there was a big storm going on at the time, so it was probably just looking for a dry place to stay. The worst or best part of the story is that the owner let the bug remain in his house until the storm was over. During an interview with The Sun, he said, it's not something I've ever seen before. I don't think it comes from this neighborhood. I will let it stay in my house, but only for the night. I don't want it to scare my guests away. Well, that's very nice of you, but I don't think you're gonna be having many guests after that. And the only way I would ever stay in that house is if my bags were packed and there was a for sale sign on my front lawn. After the videos and pictures were released of the alien, the bug was actually identified to be a moth. Listen, in Canada, I've seen moths before and they are like tiny little butterflies. What the hell kind of moth is this? Apparently it is called a Cretanotus gangus. And if I said that wrong, whatever. This insect has red or yellow bodies and is known best for its four pulsing legs that actually merge from their backsides when they are in heat. The creepy looking tentacles are actually sweat glands which expel pheromones and the hair on them wafts the smell towards the female moths. What the actual f my mind is like blown. Apparently these bugs are harmless, so having it in your home isn't any type of danger. Even knowing all of this though, it is still not enough for me to have a sleepover with it. Sorry bug, but you are getting wet. Out in the storm you go. Let me know down in the comments what you guys would have done if you saw this bug in your house. And be honest, don't try and be like a hero. Also give the video a thumbs up so that I know you enjoyed it. I'm going to end this video with some comments from my other IO video, Tom Holland rescues fan being crushed by autograph seekers. Candace says, on my birthday I found out it was also Tom Holland's. Wow, what better gift than to find out that you share a birthday with Spider-Man. I'm pretty jealous. Batman fan forever 08 says, I really don't know why humans forget to be decent human beings around celebrities. Well, I just think they get like super overwhelmed and their adrenaline's going that they just forget that like there's regular people around them. Space Addict says, oh my God, yes, it's summer break. I can watch your videos all day now. Oh, you didn't have to go to summer school like I did? True story, I failed math, but good for you and enjoy your summer. Russ says, Spider-Man. Spider-Man saves a fan like a spider can. There's no way I could just read that. Obviously, I had to sing it, so sorry that you had to witness such a thing. All right, guys, we are at the end here. If you want to keep watching more IO videos, we put together a playlist for you. It is right over here on your screen. This has been fun, minus the whole bug nightmare thing, but I will see you in a future IO video.